Okay, this is a very brief guide on how I um got I uncrouch my uncrouch inputs for fastfall for Defection 5. I used 1.4 and I actually got it pretty consistently, I think. I actually oftentimes I would practice by going like this. Wow, okay. What? What the fuck? Okay, wow. I haven't played that level in... Yeah, so I can get it pretty consistently. That may be on camera. I want to try that again, actually. But, be warned, doing it like this with your left hand index finger, you can easily... You can easily get a blister if you're not careful about it. I got it the first time I was trying to figure out, like, okay, how the fuck do I get this working? And I was just messing around, crouching like this. Someone fives, like, I guess because someone often you don't, like, record at, like, a perfect 60 FPS capture, so sometimes it'll be, like, you'll, when you go frame by frame using a comma or a period key on YouTube player, you'll see it only disappear for like once, only come up for like once sometimes on some of the fives. That's how fast it is. <laughs> it's crazy. So. Look at that. Don't, I guess, try not to do it too hard, but here we go. Yeah, so you get fast fall when you die and when you land on top of the floor, not when you fall through the floor. You fall through the floor, you're going to die immediately. But you know for sure that you have fast fall if you go to the floor and die. So, uh, let's see. Sometimes you'll just fall through the floor or fall through the wall when you're doing it. So... It doesn't mean you didn't get fastball. When the first time you get fastball, you kind of recognize immediately because you got like super fast compared to what you're used to. So that's how I do it. I think you, maybe you can kind of apply a similar concept like something like this with the R button with 1.2, but yeah, that's how I did it. I got it pretty consistently actually. And I got it more often when I was not practicing it, like. Like I showed you on there. So yeah, that's about it. Yes.